How you feeling? Good. 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 Shanka Robinson learned to live with pain after an accident 20 years ago. I fell out of car and my uh, separated my, my foot from my tibia and fibia and it was hanging by like a piece of skin. And he had these two wires. Back then, doctors reconstructed his ankle with pins. He went about his life without any big problems until he moved to Iowa this summer. You know, I thought that I had twisted it in my yard doing yard work. Came inflamed and infected and um, I had to come to the hospital. And it just kind of fell apart. He learned his talus bone in his ankle was dead and had to be removed. The nice thing is two years ago, your option would have been to go in and tear out that bone and pack this whole thing full of just a bunch of bone graft and fuse up your whole rear foot and ankle and then none of it would have ever moved again. But Dr. Micah Murdoch had a new option. I first heard about it about a year ago. It hadn't been out much longer than that. Not very many people are doing it. A total ankle replacement with a talus bone made from a 3D printer. And they use the normal ankle or the healthy ankle uh, in order to build a mirror image bone that we can use to replace the one that's been destroyed or damaged. We've had another guy since then and I've got three more on the schedule ready to go and we're just really enjoying this uh, improvement and this new technology that allows us to offer people something that, you know, has not been an option in the past for them. Really good, really good. Um, actually. Shunka was walking two weeks after his surgery. He's now doing physical therapy to restore full movement. Doc says that it'll it'll get better and better as uh, time goes on. I'm already impressed. Right. Just three, <laughs> three months. He's excited to live life to the fullest. I can actually do a little moving um, and maybe even the wife can go dancing. Ankle replacement surgery has been around for many years, but with much less success than hip or knee replacement. The replacement talus bone can also be made with titanium, but it requires six weeks to print. For HealthLink, I'm Amitia Driesi.